guys, it's Jenna. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make your own squishy. So last video I said I'm gonna make uh, a squishy. I'm gonna make a panda bun squishy. So this is the panda bun squishy that I'm gonna show you how to make. And it's really squishy. So yeah. But it's not that slow rising, so yeah. You want, what you're gonna need is your type of foam. I'm just using this foam uh, that I have in the house, and it's purple. And next, you want some cream. You can use shampoo. I'm just using anything. You can use a shower gel, conditioner, or body balm, or anything you want. So yeah. And let's start. And you'll also need your paints. You can use any type of paint. I'm just using some gouache colors and acrylic colors. You'll need scissors. I'm just using this pair of scissors. You can use any pair of scissors you'd like. And also you'll need... <coughs> Sorry. And also you'll need uh, gloves. My gloves are used by me so yeah that's why it's a bit dirty and yeah that's it that's what you're gonna need so let's start so first you want to take your foam and cut it into a dome shape into like a like this shape it's a bun shape so I'm gonna cut it into a square first, then cut it into a bun shape. So you wanna cut it into this, a small square like this, and cut it into a bun shape. So I'll break. So I cut the square, and this is how it is. And it doesn't need to be a perfect square, so yeah. Next, you just wanna cut the dome shape. I'm just going to show you this part. So you'll just need to cut it like, a square, a circle, sorry, and yeah, you just want to cut it into circle. But this part you can also just uh, put it with it the body balm or the conditioner or anything or any type of cream you want, so it's gonna make it a bit more squishier. So I finally cut it into a panda bun shape and this is going to be a medium sized panda bun so you can make it any size you want but this is going to be a medium medium sized panda bun for me so you can make a huge one a large one or a mini size i'm just going to make this a medium size so next you just want to cream it or put the cream on it so i'm going to be right back so let's just add the cream on it. So I'm just going to use a body balm. So you'll just need to put some on top of it. Oops, I added like a lot. As you can see, but that's okay because it needs to absorb it to get that squishiness. Okay. So if you added a lot, that's okay, you can use it on your hands because it is ordinary body balm. And you can squish it to get out the extras. So, yeah. And made it a bit more squishier. And slow rising. So, yeah. And it might give it a scent. It will give it a scent, which is also bonus, which is really cool. Okay, so here's my panda bun. It's not really quite finished. So this video might have two parts, I s maybe. So, yeah. Next, I'm just going to get this and predict the area for the coloring time. So I'm just going to make it into a normal pan bun. So yeah. So I had a hard time getting the gloves in and it tripped. So I'm just going to wear it like this because it is already ripped. I'm just going to do this and color it. So yeah. So here's the white.
little paint right, paint right here. And let's paint it. And you want to add a thin layer if you're adding the same as me. And if you don't want it to be cracked a lot, you need to add one of your body bombs or the moisturizer so that it moisturizes to the paint. Add a little bit. If you're using white like me, you should add the body bomb. So you just want to paint this and I'll be right back. So yeah. So I just painted it with my hands because the gloves were not working that much. So yeah, here's how it looks like. So I'm gonna come back when it's dried, so yeah. So I think now it's dried and it took a lot of minutes to dry, so yeah. Next is the panda bun face. So right here I have my panda bun and I'm just going to copy the face from here to there, so yeah. What you're going to need for that step is your pencil that you don't really want to use anymore and your black paint. So I'm just going to put the black paint right here. You don't need that much black paint, you just need a little bit. Sorry about the noises. So you just want to dip your pencil top there and you just want to draw your panda face. Um, I'm so sad, I'm so sorry. I can't really do it on camera. So I'm just going to do it off camera and I'll be right back. So this is how it looks like. And it does not look like a panda. It looks like more of a seal but that's okay and yeah we're gonna let it dry and then we're gonna see how squishy it is so we're gonna let it dry and i'll be right back so guys i've been waiting a long long time for it to dry but it didn't dry so i'm gonna make this into two parts so i'm gonna be right back um in the next part so yeah you can go to my channel which is down in the in the bar, like the bar which says subscribe, you can go to my channel, it's Sweet Jen 80, and it says keep calm and love Jenna. So you just want to press that and see the other other part, and you can see today's today's video that I've made. So yeah, my so yeah, bye guys, love you guys, peace out. I'm so tired, and now it's like six. 618 and I think I started at 5 something so yeah it's been an hour I'm here in my room for a video so yeah bye guys see you later